All right, uh, since uh, Galaxy J7 has joined, let us continue. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. Please continue with your plan. Sorry, we had to discontinue. So, oh, ma'am, uh, so, ma first I have to show them. First, I will draw a picture on a blackboard. Hello. Hello. Yes, yes, sir. You are audible. Okay, okay, ma'am. Okay. Actually, very poor, poor, poor net. No, no, there are others who are unmuted. Okay. First of all, I will show them a clock and try to draw a picture on a blackboard. So, and I tell them which one is our hand and which one is minute hand. I will show them. So they can, uh, they can understand which one is our hand and which one is minute hand. Then after that, I will show them, um, uh, uh, tell them the uh, minute and hour. The 60 minute, 60 minute is one hour and 30 minutes and half an hour. So in this way, I can understand them about the time. And after that, that, I will give them some work as, you, as their homework, as their homework. All right, what would you do in the homework? Okay, ma'am. Ma'am, is it visible? Yes, yes, you need to talk, sir. Your plan oh, okay, is absolutely okay. visible. You need to talk it. Okay, ma'am. So what is your activity that you are going to do uh, for evaluation of the uh, unit? Ma'am, I am ready to share my lesson plan. All right, I can see Titi, ma'am, having reached there. Uh, sir, I am asking, I am asking, you to aap is lesson plan bachcha samjha hai ki nahi? Aaj aapne jo clock ya time padhaya, ho bachche samjhe ki nahi? Usko aap kaise check karoge? Okay, first I will uh, give some work. First I will give some work. Then I can understand when I will check check that that copy. Then I can understand they will understand or not. All right. So then you will take a check on whether they have understood. Great. Okay, now uh, tell me, uh, I had seen um, a lot of hands going up in between. Uh, Priya Das ma'am had raised her hand. Uh, Deepa Majumdar had raised her hand. Narendra Jha sir has kept his hand raised ever since he created a lesson plan. So Narendra Jha sir, we'll go to you first. You need to unmute sir. Yes ma'am, good evening. Good evening. Uh, okay, the title of the lesson plan is Heading of Fraction. And this objective. What is the objective of this lesson plan? To understand we have, why we have to take LCM and LCM. And the center. I have give, I have given one question to the student. One and half. One and half. Add one and half and make mistake. One and half is equal to two by two or one by three. But both are wrong. Why? So, if you want to tell me, when you add one, what will happen? In real life, it will be equal to two. But in mathematics, it can be equal to the numerator, it can be equal to the denominator. After that, I will tell you what the denominator is equal to. After that, I will tell you what I have planned to do, that you can understand why I have to take the LCM and LCM. What is the importance of light fraction? Why do I convert the light fraction? I will give you a small example. 8 plus 3 is equal to 11. 
but in fractional form 8 by 1 3 by 1 is equal to 11 by 1 and that's why we have to change any fraction in like fraction by taking lcm and other thing is again i put some question to the student for the assessment and the cross curriculum is convert this thing in real life मतलब मेरे व्यवहारिक जिंदगी में क्या होता है कि यदि मैं किसी को बोलता हूँ कि एक रुपया आपके पास है और पच्चीस पैसा मैं दे रहा हूँ तो वो बोल रहा है कि आपके पास एक रुपया पच्चीस पैसा होता है लेकिन मैथमेटिक्स में जब मैं बच्चों को बोलने देता हूँ तो वहां पर वह हो सकता है कि तो उसको छब्बीस पैसा बोल दे छब्बीस पैसा बोल दे तो वहां पर मुझे इम्पोर्टेंस समझाना पड़ता है कि लाइफ फ्रैक्शन या लाइफ बेसिमल में कन्वर्ट कैसे किया जाता है और उसके लिए फिर जैसे मान लीजिए कि ये कम्प्लीटेड होल है और जैसे इसको पार्ट करते हैं तो ये ये दोनों ही पार्ट क्या हो जाता है एक फ्रैक्शन हो जाता है फिर दोनों पार्ट को यदि हम ऐड करते हैं फिर ये वन हो जाता है तो इस तरीके का एक्टिविटी कुछ रियल लाइफ से रिलेटेड बातों को बताना डिफ्रेंशिएट करना और उसको कई क्वेश्चन देना ताकि वह समझ सके कि कैसे हम लोग फ्रैक्शन को एड कर सकते बड़ा अच्छा प्लान बनाया सर आपको बहुत बहुत बधाइया आपने बिल्कुल कम समय लेकर इतना अच्छा प्लान बना दिया सो प्रिया दास मैम एंड दीपा मजुमदार मैम आई मूव ऑन टू बोथ ऑफ यू प्लीज स्विच ऑन योर वीडियोस एंड अनम्यूट गुड इवनिंग मैम गुड इवनिंग मैम एक्चुअली वी आर इन आउटस्कर्ट्स एरिया सो अवर network is not so good if i will switch on the cameras so maybe you will not be able to hear my voice or you will not be able to uh, clearly see me so is it All okay right. if i so will so it's okay you can stay without the video but you need to definitely unmute and speak your plan ma'am yes so i used to teach uh, uh, social study in uh, class 6 7 8 and 9 so i will uh, discuss lesson plan that i prepared for class 8 uh, so that my uh, what the the lesson plan i prepared for the chapter second of history that is from trade to territory and did you prepare it for the entire chapter or for one part no ma'am i prepared it for the entire chapter only okay so how many so, periods uh, did you assign to it i as uh, my uh, pattern of uh, uh, teaching is bit lengthy and also a uh, bit understanding so that is the reason why i have taken around uh, sev- uh, around uh, one week time which is going to consist of six periods all right okay uh, and i have kept uh, pre quizit uh, knowledge first then short discrimination regarding the lesson and then the objectives aids supplementary activities and procedures and then we i kept uh, expected outcomes all right so uh, what did you write in each for at least uh, share one uh, unit with me i think that chapter yeah. begins with the coming of robert clive yeah so uh, this chapter which is talking about the um, setting up of the british east india company and the first english factory in india and uh, i have taken uh, uh, obviously the um, textbook blackboard chalk and uh, i have also taken the list that uh, list of governor generals and uh, different acts that has been introduced during the british east india company uh, british uh, colonial rule i prepared a chart for by myself only uh, where i have uh, mentioned a lot of uh, names of the uh, different uh, governor general and the viceroy names and what are the important acts they have uh, uh, introduced during that period so right. via this uh, i wanted to convey them that uh, what were the slow and steady way uh, to inter- uh, to setting up the british uh, colonial rule in india 
and uh, then i have added the supplementary activities with it like uh, i asked them to read about or to write uh, some kind of uh, things about the dutch also the french also and the portuguese trading post that were there in india and i at the same time i also made them understand that uh, what were and how uh, uh, british east india accord uh, with the british east india company how the dutch and french and portuguese were also uh, introducing the naval setup in india okay and uh, how did you integrate uh, different subjects of the curriculum sorry ma'am how will you integrate different subjects of the curriculum via uh, current affairs ma'am okay, via the so, different current uh, affairs and the different articles which used to published in the one of the relevant newspaper uh, the hindu all right uh, that is very nice of you uh, it also uh, gives me immense pleasure to welcome ma'am kavita khan uh the principal of uh, zenith public school uh welcome ma'am uh would you want to address the uh, educators kavita ma'am all right i think uh, she is also having an issue so let's go back to uh, priya das ma'am yes ma'am good evening ma'am good evening priya das ma'am uh, ma'am actually i am in a border area so there is lot of network problems so won't be able to switch on the video not at all uh, no issue at all ma'am you can just talk about your subject your plan your topic actually ma'am i teach english in junior section in mithila public school okay and uh, i have prepared a lesson plan for class 4 students that is on a chapter uh, called neha's alarm clock so in that chapter ma'am uh, i have uh, described or i have let students know about uh, the importance of body clock and waking up early the whole chapter is based on that so for uh, that at first i had uh, made students uh, start reading the chapter like imitation reading using correct phrases and uh, words were uh, emphasized properly after that i had given uh, the list of uh, difficult and new words so that they will be able to understand it more clearly and then uh, in teaching aids i had used blackboard books and some uh, flash cards that i have prepared myself related to the words which are related to uh, waking up early morning time and chart paper uh, you uh, with a drawing of alarm clock and its part and at the end uh, i had introduced uh, like evaluation with the question answer that is in the book and apart from that i had given them some kind of project works and memory uh, cards to uh, enhance their memory also and to check their skills that what they have learned in the chapter till date all right so did you not think of any song and dance since it's only class 4 did you not think of any song and dance uh, connecting to the alarm clock actually when the chapter was connected with the poem too so mm. uh, i had uh, like uh, made them uh, uh, practice that poem in a form of song in the class okay and i had tried uh, to make them learn uh, those uh, <laughs> imitations through that poem only all right thank you ma'am thank you so uh, manjula thakur ma'am let's hear from you manjula thakur
Okay, Prabesh Tamang. Prabesh Tamang. Let's hear from you. Rajesh Kumar, sir. Good evening, ma'am. Okay, Manjula, ma'am is here. Yes, ma'am. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening. I'm Hindi Parati. I'm in Mithla Public School. I'm in Mithla Public School. And I'm in Hindi class, ma'am. Yes. Do you study in which class are you in Hindi? Ma'am, I'm in 4, 5, 6, 7. बड़ी अच्छी बात है मैम तो आज आपने कौन सा विषय लिया है मैम आज मैं कविता पढ़ा के आई हूँ वर्षा रितु बिल्कुल बहुत बहुत बढ़िया कविता है वो तो बताइए आपने कौन सा प्लान बनाया क्या लिखा प्लान में उस कविता पर मैम एक्चुअली इस कविता में मैंने बच्चों को वर्षा रितु के आगमन के विषय में बताया कि इस तरह गर्मी से धरती तपती है और वर्षा ऋतु आती है तो चारों तरफ शीतलता छा जाती है इंसान तो इंसान पेड़ पौधे भी आ, राहत महसूस करते हैं नदियां भी जो सूख जाती है उसमें वर्षा ऋतु के आगमन से नवयौवन को प्राप्ति मिलती है right. और इसके इसके कठिन शब्दों को मैंने बच्चों को लिखवाया और समझाया अच्छी तरह से मैम right. और आपने और क्या क्या किया है मैम जैसे हमें तो आपकी मैं... क्लास में जैसे इंक्लूसिव एजुकेशन लगाना था तो आप क्या करती मैम आपकी आवाज क्लियर नहीं आ रही है आपको इंक्लूसिव एजुकेशन करना होता तो आप क्या करती तो मैम मैं कुछ नया करने की कोशिश करते ओके जैसे मैं बच्चों को जैसे मैं बच्चों को लेकर वर्षा आने पर आउटडोर में खड़े हो के वर्षा किस तरह बरसती है और पेड़ पौधे पे किस तरह वर्षा आती है तो हरियाली चारों तरफ छा जाती है उन दृश्यों को बच्चों को दिखाती तो उसमें इंक्लूसिव क्या होता है ये तो आप बच्चों को नेचुरलिस्ट एजुकेशन करवाती इंक्लूसिव तो अलग बात हो गई ना इंक्लूसिव इंक्लूसिव मतलब जो बच्चे विकलांग हैं, जिनके पास या तो सोशियो इकोनॉमिकली वीक बैकग्राउंड है जो सी डब्ल्यू एस एन कैंडिडेट है उनके लिए आप इस चैप्टर वर्षा ऋतु को कैसे अलग से पढ़ाती मैम इसके लिए मैं कुछ जैसे सावर का उसमें कुछ चीज मैं लेती और उसमें पानी भर के जैसे मैं एक डब्बा ही लेती उसमें कील से छिद्र करती उसके बाद उसमें पानी डाल के मैं बच्चों को दिखाती या मैं बगीचे में जो पानी भरने वाला होता है जिससे हम लोग वाटर प्लान वाटर में वाटर प्लानिंग करते हैं कहने का मतलब पानी डालते हैं जिससे उसके द्वारा बच्चों को दिखाती कि वर्षा होने पर क्या होता है right. और इसी तरह का कुछ मैं क्रिएट करने की कोशिश करती बड़ी अच्छी बात है तो सत्यजीत ठाकुर सर आप बार बार अपने आप को अनम्यूट कर रहे हैं तो चलिए आपकी ओर चलते हैं यस yes, मैम आप क्या कौन सी स्कूल से हैं और कौन सा सब्जेक्ट पढ़ाते हैं जी मैं जिनिक पब्लिक स्कूल से मैम हाँ जी और प्लस टू डिपार्टमेंट बिजनेस स्टडीज में सब्जेक्ट कौन सा डिपार्टमेंट कॉमर्स स्ट्रीम ओके 
ब्लैकबोर्ड एंड मार्कर एंड ऑल्सो सो सम Uh, in the smart boards so that i can uh, uh, bifurcate about the primary sector secondary sector what about the tertiary sector and what are the services which we used to offer to the secondary and primary sectors so that the business uh, smoothly can running out no so these are the stating ends and uh, what have you done for differentiation in your classroom differentiation between uh you have a diversity of learners so how are you going to create yeah, yeah. Uh, your lesson plan which is going to meet the diverse learners needs basically we can use the questionnaire method ma'am so that uh, we can just ask the questions and account according to that uh, uh, marks obtained by the students we can uh, bifurcate um, the students on as per their skills so those students who are getting less marks we can uh, provide some extra uh, knowledge to them so we can give some extra time to them and we then we can boost up the knowledge so the questionnaire method as per uh, my thinking questionnaire method is the best uh, um, way to segregate the students as per their skill all right uh, thank you uh, so much sir so yeah welcome uh, ma'am yes nice to talk to you same here sir uh anyone else who wishes to share a lesson plan uh, with the larger group someone who's created a lesson plan but did not get a chance to speak may one have wanted to speak hello ma'am hello sir uh i am rajesh kumar Yes, sir. Absolutely. You are I now added into the spotlight. Last ten. Uh, we 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 take something uh, about topics of relative speed in class ten when I taught was. Uh, speed of boat equal to x kilometer per hour and speed of train equal to y kilometer per hour then what is the relation relative speed of boat uh, situation is to first situation is when water current and boat both are in same direction then what is the relative speed of boat and current so i uh, take a figure of boat and current wonderful sir figure okay i saw the flow chart yes yes this types and we say that when current is flow and boat is also flow in same direction then uh, the speed of boat and the speed of current is added and real is x plus y kilometer per hour this All is right. the down stream This is the downstream. Yes, and after this case, second case is upstream. I think you're frozen. Rajesh Kumar ji. move out of the room and is opposite
Rajesh Kumar ji, move out of the room. Yes, yes, ma'am. Sir, you're not audible to us. Uh, some technical error. Yes, it's a technical error. Uh, yes, when sir. Both, when both opposite to the water current, then then again, what happens, sir? Then relative speed is x plus y kilometer per hour. All right. Down stream in opposite direction में x minus y kilometer per hour. In opposite direction x minus y kilometer per hour. These topics help us uh, help the boys to Memorize the some situational problem on pair of linear equations. All right. Thank you so much, sir. That was a very brilliant uh, one on the speed of the boat. Uh, do we have any other uh, lovely, sir? Do we have any other participant who wishes to uh, talk or present? If you have not yet presented. <laughs> Titi ma'am is right here. She wishes to talk. Yes, Titi ma'am. She's been moving uh, all around the school. Uh, Titi ma'am, you need to unmute. Yes. I did. Ma'am, uh, in a very uh, easy method, I have made one. Like my topic is how I taught my grandmother to read. This is my lesson. So that's why I have made. Like at the beginning, general objective, specific objectives, teaching method, teaching aid. And then uh, these are all uh, previous knowledge, the way I have been taught in uh, my B.H. announcement of the topic and presentation and then at last uh, recapitulation homework and cl blackboard work activity this way ma'am i have made now we so what have you put in special in your lesson plan ma'am Ma'am, I would like to use the uh, whiteboard that is because it is available out there so that it would be audio-visual aid. It will always be very much attractive for the students. Lecture method is a uh, one-way method, ma'am. But if we are taking the children out there and by using the whiteboard, it will attract them. I can show them. And as, apart from that, uh, regarding art integration, ma'am, in English literature, a lot of scopes are there. So, ma'am, we can use dramatization. And uh, as per the topic, I can choose that novel. Okay, of Sudha Murti, written by Sudha Murti. I can, as a uh, teaching aid, also I can use that. Oh, nothing else. My muse has, uh, just give me something so that I can use further. I will go into the class. Wonderful. And uh, you also interlinked art, uh, try to integrate art into your topic. That's another great idea. And I think uh, with this, we are done with almost all those who wished uh, to present today. And uh, I think we can uh, thank everyone, uh, Putul ma'am, and uh, the principal of the Zenith uh, Public School as well. And of course, Titi ma'am, who's been coordinating day and night to put all the sessions together. Uh, we must also uh, thank uh, Shri Tarun Kumar, sir, Deputy Secretary and Head, uh, CBSC Center of Excellence, Patna, who is uh, put these sessions in place and of course all you wonderful participants who've taken so much time after school to sit back listen to a session and create your own hands-on lesson plan this time we've moved away from a total lecture method to letting you create your lesson plans 
uh, looking forward to seeing more of you create your own lesson plans and the template I gave you based on the NEP and the curriculum of the CBSC 22-23. Hoping to see more such lesson plans in the future. Thank you once again, everyone. I think we can end the meeting now. Uh, wishing you, you a very great evening and a lovely weekend. Take rest. Thank you, one another. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Thank, thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Hello.